friends, welcome back. Today we are going to paint a haunted mansion. You will need your three primary colors: red, yellow, and blue. You'll also need a white and a sharpie if you want to draw your haunted mansion first. So, shall we get going? Okay, the first thing I'm going to do do is draw my haunted mansion. Okay, you can draw any shape you like. I'm just going to go for the typical rectangle haunted mansion. So, shall we go? Okay, here we go. I'm going to go up. And I'm gonna I'm gonna throw like this little triangle guy here like this. I'm gonna have my mansion a little bit wonky. And maybe then this is gonna go up like this and across. And maybe this is gonna go ooh, like that. Now you don't have to do the same shapes as me, but I kind of like this triangle shape, sort of rectangle. I don't know what it is. Let's just go for it. And then let's do this pointy guy here. This is going to be our roof. Look how big that is. Okay, now we've got our haunted mansion shape. Let's draw in some doors and windows. So shall we make it extra spooky and give it some eyes? Like this? How about that, eh? They look like ice cream cone, cones, don't they? They look like ice cream cones. Okay, let's do ha 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 big mouth for our little haunted mansion. I'm quite happy with that. You can go ahead and add more if you like. I quite like it. Okay, now it's time to get painting. You can paint your background any color that you like. I'm gonna go with, hmm, I think green. Let's go for green. Let's find a paintbrush. It would help if I already had a paintbrush. Let's find a paintbrush. I've lost my paintbrush. Okay, I found some paintbrushes. Let's get painting. Let's use a big one for the background. Okay, I'm going to do my mansion green. As you can tell, I've already been painting today. It's been a bit messy. Let's get some blue. And I'm going to take a lot of yellow. Let's mix that in. Okay, we're going to have this spooky green color. Hmm, that's quite blue green, isn't it? We can go ahead and add more yellow if we like. Maybe underneath a little bit of yellow. Okay, let's get painting. Now, I might paint my background in like swirls like this. I think that's quite cool. You can go ahead and do that too, if you like. It just adds something, doesn't it? It just looks a little bit more like, I don't know, what's the word? Swirly? <laughs> is swirly the word? I don't know. You kids have to tell me, what is the word? Is it swirly? Is it crazy? Is it a bit of both? Maybe I might go in and add a bit more blue to my green. So we get another green, but this one's even more like dark. Ooh, spooky green. I kind of like this style. This is really fun. Let me know if you like it. You can just paint it, of course. I just like doing the swirls. I think they're really fun. Ha 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 ha, swirly, swirly green. I know, Jenny, stop doing the voices. I can't help it. I kind of like doing the voices. <laughs> if you like me doing the voices, give this video a thumbs up because I'd love to know if you like me doing the voices. If you don't like me doing the voices, then I guess just shout through your TV screen. Jenny, stop doing the voices. I probably won't hear you, but I'll try. Okay, we got the swirly whirly background. I kind of like it. It's giving me swirly vibes. We're just going to go in and just fill all the gaps now. Oops, <laughs> don't worry if you paint into the mansion. That's okay, because we're going to paint it black. We're going to cover over the mansion. I kind of like this swirly background. Okay, call me crazy. I'm going to add some more yellow to this. Let's get some more yellowy green going on. We've got a lot of dark green. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to add some white. I know, I know you didn't see that coming. But look at this, okay? I've already got paint on my brush. And look what's happening now. It's just like, I don't know. It's just so cool. There's so much going on here right now. The thing with art is that we can kind of create whatever we like. It's our own world. So there's no right or wrong. No matter what we do. Because it's art. You either like it or you don't like it. But it doesn't matter because it's your art. You can do whatever you like. Let's just do some weird like swirls with the white paint now. Let's get that looking all swirly whirly. I kind of like this. It's fun. 
I know I'm talking a lot today. I'm sorry. Maybe I will just stop me talking and put some nice cool music on for you guys. <laughs> Where's the fun in that? Okay, I think we've like covered all the ground here. Okay, we have our swirly whirly background. I just went for like lots of different greens and then I added some white on top because that's really fun. Okay, I mean the brush is really mucky so we should give that a wipe and let's get some black. And some yellow because that's all we're gonna need now black and yellow I kind of like the swirly background you see how it stuck the masking tape down let me just peel that off because now we've done the border we don't need it and you'll be able to see how cool it makes the picture it adds like a frame oh don't tear it just be careful do not tear your paper oh my goodness oh my gosh you know what it adds character it adds character here we go. All right, now can you see it? It's got a cool border. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna paint these little windows in yellow and the house, we're gonna paint it in black. You know what? I don't have any black on my palette. It's like I just completely forgot about black. Hmm, so let's get painting the black. I don't know what paintbrush I'm using. I just picked up a random paintbrush. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Like, I hope you are watching this when it is Halloween, otherwise you're going to be watching me paint a spooky house in the summer or maybe at Christmas. <laughs> it's very seasonal. I really hope you're watching this in October. Okay, let's go. Give me a thumbs up for this video if you are American. Americans are so good at Halloween. They do the best Halloween ever. Us Brits, it's not as good. It's a little bit boring. We don't have as much fun. Ooh, I mean, we dress up, but only for like one day. Like Americans like go crazy. They, they have the Halloween decorations up all month. They do like Halloween trees. They do all sorts. It's so cool. Give this video a thumbs up if you're American. I would like to know. Okay, let's go around. Make sure you don't get your black in these little white edges. You see how the house looks like it's got it's got hands and it's got a mouth. It is pretty cute. It's not scary, not really. Well, maybe a little bit scary. Ah. I like the Halloween Halloween painting. Jenny, stop singing. I can't. Somebody stop me, please. Okay, I'll stop. I'm sorry. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We've done it. Look. We. Oh, I went outside the edge. That's okay. I should have waited with the tape. Okay, we definitely did it. Well, maybe I'm just going to paint that a little bit more like that. You see what I'm doing there? Just covering up that white. Yeah, it's like it never happened. There we go. Okay, we have it. We have our spooky house now. Let's put some yellow in there. I'm sorry, the camera totally wobbled on me then. So I need some more yellow, okay? Like, I have no colors today. All my colors are running out. <laughs> okay, are you ready to paint inside the windows? You might be wondering, why have you got blue paint on yourself? You know what? Sometimes I'm just a little bit messy and I like to paint. So it sort of like this gets me messy all the time. Oh look. Oh my gosh. I mean I paint for my job, so I'm just always messy. Right, this is cool. I'm liking this. Oh my gosh. I love this house. You know what? I was gonna add some bats to the sky, but I don't think I'm going to because this is too cool. I don't know if it needs bats. Shall we add bats? Do you want to shout yes or no? Okay, we've got a few yeses. Maybe we should add some bats. Hmm. Right, okay then. You said yes. Let's add some bats. Why not? Let's go crazy. I'm going to use this brush. I'm just going to give it a little bit of a wash. <gasps> we've got some black paint left. Let's do some bats then. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Like, okay, okay, we're doing it. Zigzag, zigzag. Little dot in the middle and zigzag, zigzag. We have a little bat. We can make it bigger. I think we should make it bigger because it kind of looks tiny. We want a big bat. Uh, 
why am I doing this? I feel like I've just ruined my painting. <laughs> oh, does it look okay? I don't know. I don't know. You told me to do a bat. I don't know I'm doing the bat. Okay. I don't know if this is going right, guys. Does that look like a bat? I think it looks like a bat. <laughs> Maybe let's give him some ears. There we go. We have a bat. You know what? I'm just going to stick with the one bat. You can do like loads of bats if you like. Just do the zigzags for the wings, a circle for the body, and two little, little like lines for the ears. Okay, that is my Halloween painting. Let me know if you enjoyed it. Just give it a thumbs up. That's how you can let me know. And I hope you did enjoy it. I've also got a free coloring book. It's in the description box. If you know an adult, if you, I hope you do know an adult, <laughs> then just ask them to download it and they can print it off for you and you can color in. But I hope you're doing this. This is really fun. All right, kids. Well, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for coming and painting spookiness with me. See you later. Bye.